Boston and welcome to Insiders Health TV where we bring you the freshest happenings in the world of medicine without the quack propaganda. Today we'll be talking about how breaking some of the rules can be good for your health. Are you trying your best to be a good girl? Well stop it because it might just be unhealthy. While scientists have already given their blessings to guilty pleasures like chocolate and wine, here are a few more naughty habits that can make you feel good and be good for you. Every now and then get pissed off. I said pissed off, not pissed on. That's right, a little anger can actually help keep your stress in check. And researchers at Carnegie Mellon University found that riled up people make better decisions. They also found that anger can prompt your brain to release less cortisol, the stress hormone linked to obesity, bone loss, and heart disease. So next time you get cut off, make sure you do a little screaming and flip them the bird. Another bad habit that might be healthy is being a slob. Well, your house should at least be clean enough to pass codes. Being overly disinfectant in your home will actually clear the way for more serious or resistant strains of germs. And many disinfectant sprays and air fresheners release chemicals that can heighten asthma risk. And there's nothing sexy about wheezing and phlegm. What about the beer drinkers out there? Go ahead and slug one back. It turns out that malted barley happens to contain the same antioxidants that give red wine its good name. But beer also packs high levels of vitamin B6 and silica, which can help to strengthen bones. But let's not get carried away. Keep it to a minimum so you don't end up in your neighbor's hot tub again. Our last tip, if you've ever been told to stop chewing gum because it's so rude, you can simply respond that chewing gum can improve both short and long-term memory even though scientists have no idea why. Or did they just forget? Research also suggests that frequent chewing can stimulate the brain's satiety center, which is responsible for making us feel full. So you might just be able to chew your way through size two while having the freshest breath out of all your friends. It turns out that some things that we think might be bad for us can actually do some good. So you're welcome, since we basically gave you all the excuses that you need. That's it for this edition of Insiders Health TV. Get on with your naughty self. I'm your host, Kimberly Walson, and remember, it's your health. We're just helping you think outside.